If a green flag is flying on Pensacola Beach, conditions are calm and capable swimmers can swim with usual care. Remember, it's always safest to swim near the lifeguards. More Safe Shores is brought to you by Pete Moore Chevrolet and WEAR. Researchers are wrapping up the first phase of their grave excavation at the former Dozier School for Boys. Two skeletons that have been unearthed are on their way right now to the University of South Florida. Researchers will work to figure out who was found in the graves and collect more evidence on the remains. Preliminary analysis of dental remains should, you know, suggest they're probably 10 to 13 years old. We get whatever information we can and write up a little narrative about that individual and send the samples off for DNA testing. Researchers believe about 50 people were buried in the cemetery. The goal is to identify those buried in the graves and determine how they died. Ten families have contacted the school with hopes that DNA will help identify relatives who died there.